Hello everyone, we're out in our 1999 Rolls-Royce Seraph, uh, finished in Iridium Metallic Pearl. Iridium Pearl Metallic. Uh, I got it. Uh, 14,000 original miles, 23,233 original kilometers. Uh, this vehicle's from Vancouver. Uh, was sold new at Rolls-Royce Vancouver, at the time was MCL Motorcars. Um, and it's just in absolutely stunning condition. Um, many of these cars, uh, they have come from Florida most often, it seems. And, you know, all the wood gets milky and faded. And, you know, it's a really expensive process to make, uh, get the wood back to how it should be. So in our climate, we don't have the extreme highs or lows in temperature. Most of these cars are garage kept in, uh, you know, a very moderate temperature their entire life and only driven in the summertime. Um, we get a lot of rain here, so that uh, prevents people from driving their nice cars. Um, so that's likely why this one has such low mileage. Um, driving it, it drives exactly how it should. Uh, no real weird shakes or rattles or anything that uh, I would say detours from the overall driving experience. Um, it's got the beautiful nice Vogue tires on it which I absolutely love. I think it makes a real difference to the presence of the car. Um, everything works. We've, we've tried all the heated seats in the car. Joel's in the back being driven around like he's a king. Um, and all the seat switches, window switches, uh, hazard lights, windshield wipers. We've tried every single switch in the car and as far as we can see, every single thing works other than one light bulb in the back uh, that Joel found was out. So we're going to uh, going to see if we get that fixed. Um, but other than that, the steering column goes up and down as it should. The seats go back and forth as they should. I'll just try all the windows. There's the drivers up and down. Passengers rear, up and down. Passenger rear, up and down. And that one up and down. Passenger seat, forward, back, forward, back, up, down, up down um, all the memory positions uh, they seem to work uh, we tried those radio is behind here works as it should um, the heating system driver's side Side. Uh, air conditioning is nice and cold. I've got it set at one of the lowest settings right now. It's nice and cold. So no issues with uh, the air conditioning system. Transmission shifts perfectly. No issues there at all. We'll turn here. And we're going to do uh, a bit of a highway run. Really, really stunning car. Has all its uh, books, records, and tools. Service records go back to 2008. Um, we have spare keys with the car. The alarm system, the keyless entry function works properly. Uh, so no real concerns at all with the car. We'll show you the underside photos so that you can see exactly the condition of the underside also. Um, but we're super impressed with uh, with the condition overall. Um, we'll do a walk around with paint meter reading so you can see exactly uh, the paint meter th uh, thickness. Um, so we're just coming on to highway approach here. This V12 is very, very smooth. It's I don't know if you know this, but I don't think you can merge uh, southbound. No, we're going to go north. All right.
This vehicle uh, is compliant 100% in, uh, in the USA. There's nothing that you need to change. The speedometer uh, reads in both miles and kilometers, so uh, you don't have to change that. In US EPA uh, compliant and California compliant. a drive-thru. Have you got any great coupon? No, it's um, it's a pretty outstanding car. That uh, The last rolls I think we sold on Bring a Trailer out of Scottsdale was an early 2000s car. Uh, it had low mileage. Yeah. It, I, I'm more impressed by this car than I am that one. Um, yeah, like I was saying in the walk around and Tim was just pointing out is that the condition in which cars stay, as far as uh, the materials and the interior and the woods and the high-end Bentleys and Rolls, um, it stays very much like new and the in entire interior is very much like that. It's all the wood is gleaming and super glossy. Uh, the interior smells exactly as it should, like, like rich leather. Um, it's just a really, really nice car. Really nice car. Uh, I love the color of it. I like the colors in the interior. Obviously, I think whoever placed that order, it was a bit of a gamble. As you see a lot in Bentleys, uh, some strange color combinations. I wouldn't call this strange. I, I love the the originality of the exterior and, and the colors on the interior work really well. So. The brakes and suspension and everything feel great also. This is... Uh Obviously, uh, you know, a 20-year-old car now, so you expect some some things to be worn, but it really does ride exactly as uh, I remember them to ride back in the day when this was a $300,000 car. So I think uh, I think you'll be overall very impressed with how the car drives. I think it's probably should mention that I forget what Rolls Royce calls it, but it has an auto leveling. A suspension so in corners like the one we just did which was a clover leaf uh, the car stays quite planted actually and not a lot of body roll very smooth cup holders are there yeah I might as well sh show in the back as well cup holders no problem cigarette lighter is brand new doing 60 miles an hour it's dead smooth straight alignments perfect really uh, really impressed with the car um, many of you will want to uh, import the car to the United States we can handle it all for you there's 2.8 percent duty which is due on the value of the vehicle to US Customs it's approximately another $750 in fees, which are um, cust uh, sorry, the customs broker fees and the importer fees. Um, there's no speedometer to change, so you don't have that expense. And then shipping will be from Blaine, Washington if you import it into the US. We're happy to take care of, care of it for you. It does have to pass US EPA and DOT. Uh, which is a 30-day process uh, that it needs to be held. So we can hold it uh, at the EPA uh, compliant warehouse so the car is kept in perfect condition. We've, been, we've done over 100 auctions on the current trailer and definitely are familiar with the whole process. We can get the car titled for you in the U.S. and make sure it's you know a seamless process from you, for you from the start to the end. 
any questions please reach out please uh, read through the auction completely we try and answer every question we can uh, before it comes up we'll have all the paid meter readings and whatnot that people always ask for um, and we'll state the fact that it is US uh, California compliance that is one of the favorite questions that uh, we get asked um, reach out if you have any specifics we can answer uh, read through the service records they're all there uh, and we'll show you all the items that come with the vehicle there is a spare fifth Vogue tire in the trunk it's dated uh, from 2012 so I assume all four tires are the same date codes but they're all in extremely good condition uh, the gentleman that owned the car previously he said that he bought an extra tire because he knows how hard they are to get so he wanted to make sure if there ever was a flat there is a spare that goes with it thanks for coming to our auction it is being sold no reserve uh, so high bid will get it